not substantial, some mild back pain periodically, comes and goes. Um, she's in great shape, she's very active, she's going to the gym. Um, she does have a history of some scoliosis, relatively around 30 degrees, so that does throw off some imbalances and will create some areas of stiffness and some pain periodically. So what we're gonna do today is we're gonna get her into the best position we can and get her moving properly in areas where there might be some restriction or she's stuck. Okay. So with Lily, a lot of her pain is from pretty much here down. Uh, because of the curvature she has, uh, there are muscles that are gonna be more stretched and, and stressed than others, so we wanna make sure that we can get her as balanced as possible, take some stress off the joints, make sure everything's moving properly. Uh, let's start down here and check her legs. So not too bad, pretty good. Okay, her hips are a little bit rotated. So we're gonna work on that today, just relax a little. If any of this pressure's too much, Lily, just let me know. Okay. Don't be afraid to speak up or kick me or whatever, okay? Some of these spots are gonna feel a little tender. What we're doing is we're assessing all the muscles of the lower back and hips, checking some of the glute fibers out. Everything connects to there, so we want to make sure that they're, they're functional and working as they should. Okay. Same thing on this side. Now this hip's a little bit higher than the other one. I don't know if you can see it on the video, but we're going to work to balance that out the best we can today. So what you're going to feel is it's the table drop down as I press down on this joint here, okay? You okay with that? Mm -hmm. We're going to do that one more time. Good. This okay, this pressure? That's great. Good, yeah. <laughs> Most people love this machine. This is a uh, percussor, uh, kind of like a vibration, massage. What it does is it loosens up the muscles, helps to increase circulation of blood and oxygen throughout the muscles and joints. And it just feels really good. All right, pretty tight in here. Okay, I'm just going to apply a little bit of pressure here. If it's too much, just let me know. Just breathe naturally. pressure to some of the tightness in her right side of her trap muscle here to release it a little bit. What I want you to do is lay on your side with this side up, facing me, please. Just like you do, kind of put you into like a pretzel position. Relax like that. And I'm gonna rotate you towards me. Feel that little release in there? Good, excellent. Okay? No pain, right? No, that's great. Cool, awesome. Go to the other side. That way, good. Okay, let's have you lay on your back. And then just scoot down on the table to me a little bit, a little lower. Right there. Okay, bend your knees, put your feet flat on the table. What I want you to do is cross your arms like this, nice and tight, like give yourself a big hug. Now I'm going to give you a big hug. Take a deep breath in, all the way out, let go. Okay, feel that? Again, one more time. All the way out, let it go. Okay, let's move over to your stomach again, please. So we got movement in the lower thoracics here, not so much up here. So we're going to put a little bit of a force into here. Gentle way of kind of getting those bones to oscillate a little bit. And again, free up any restrictions in the joints. Cool. Okay, you're just going to relax this arm for me, and we're just going to push here, and you're going to come all up your head. Okay. Just kind of shading the scapula here, the shoulder blade. So 
So we've got some better movement and positioning here as well as down the lower back and hips. Now we're going to flip over on your back and we're going to check out your upper back and your neck. There's a lot of tension yeah. here. It's part of being a student. Kind of looking down and reading all the time or getting phone. Good. Excellent. Awesome. Now we're getting some more motion here. You're gonna immediately feel the difference how these vertebrae are moving. And not stuck. Awesome. Let's set up facing this way. We call this our postural adjustment. It's geared to combat all the cell phones and computer use and books. What we're gonna do is we're gonna keep our shoulders nice and tight like that. And what you're gonna do is as I come up your spine, what you're gonna do is I want you to slowly bring your head back and look towards the ceiling. So keep going, keep going, and right keep going. Relax, back to center now, back down. Good. Awesome, look straight ahead. Now we're going to stand up. One of the things I noticed with Lily in her examination was her shoulder was uneven. So we're going to work on that too. Uh, I want you to turn and face that way. Okay, arms by your sides. Okay, it's actually a little better for us improving this, but you can see how you're still kind of wrenched over to the left. What I want you to do is from the hip, I want you to bend to the right. Oh no, I'm sorry, from your thoracic spine. So from like this, watch. So move over like this. So kind of bend over to the right. Good. Hold that position, keep your head straight like that. Good. And what we're going to do is we're going to tap a little bit down here. What this does is stimulate some of the nerves, the receptors in the joints. And you can tell Millie really bring where we want her posture to be. Back to center. Good. All right, that's, that's already improved significantly. Okay. All right, turn and face me. right here. So, how would you feel? It felt amazing. Honestly. Good. Excellent. Um, no problems with the treatment? Nothing no. was painful? No, it was Nothing great. This good. was my first time getting it done too. Sure. Awesome. Cool. So, you can see the benefits of, we don't really know how good we feel until we actually get things in the right position and see how things normally should move. But that's awesome. Good. good. So, no, no issues? No. Great. Awesome. Um, that's all we have today for our treatment video. Uh, if you like the video, please click like, comment, and share. If you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel yet, please do so. There's a lot of good information, videos like this, as well as research, um, health news, there's a lot of good stuff on there. And for more information, you can always visit our website at fanwinbackrelief.com. And we're here to help. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.